Devarim, Deuteronomy 26. And it shall be, when you are come in unto the land which Yahuwah, Eloheka, gives you for an inheritance, and possess it, and dwell therein, that you shall take of the first of all the fruit of the earth, which you shall bring of your land that Yahuwah, Eloheka, gives you, and shall put it in a basket, and shall go unto the place which Yahuwah, Eloheka, shall choose to place his name there. And you shall go unto the priest that shall be in those days, and say unto him, I profess this day unto Yahuwah, Eloheka, that I am come unto the country which Yahuwah swore unto our fathers for to give us. And the priest shall take the basket out of your hand and set it down before the altar of Yahuwah, Eloheka. And you shall speak and say before Yahuwah, Eloheka, an Arami ready to perish was my father, and he went down into Mitzrayim and sojourned there with a few and became there a nation, great, mighty, and populous, and the Mitzrayim evil entreated us, and afflicted us, and laid upon us hard bondage. And when we cried unto El Yahuwah, Elohai of our fathers, Yahuwah heard at our voice, and looked on at our affliction, and at our labor, and at our oppression. And Yahuwah brought us forth out of Mitzrayim with a mighty hand, and with an outstretched arm, and with great terribleness, and with signs, and with wonders. And he has brought us into this place, and has given us at this land, even a land that flows with milk and honey. And now, behold, I have brought at the first fruits of the land, which you, O Yahuwah, have given me. And you shall set it before Yahuwah Eloheka, and worship before Yahuwah Eloheka. And you shall rejoice in every good thing which Yahuwah Eloheka has given unto you and unto your house, you and the Levi and the stranger that is among you. When you have made an end of tithing at all the tithes of your increase, the third year, which is the year of tithing, and have given it unto the Levi, the stranger, the fatherless, and the widow, that they may eat within your gates and be filled. Then you shall say before Yahuwah Eloheka, I have brought away the hallowed things out of my house, and also have given them unto the Levi, and unto the stranger, 
to the fatherless and to the widow, according to all your commandments, which you have commanded me. I have not transgressed your commandments, neither have I forgotten them. I have not eaten thereof in my mourning, neither have I taken away aught thereof for any unclean use, nor given aught thereof for the dead. But I have hearkened to the voice of Yahuwah Elohai, and have done according to all that you have commanded me. Look down from your holy habitation from heaven and bless at your people at Yahshara'el and at the land which you have given us as you swore unto our fathers, a land that flows with milk and honey. This day, Yahuwah Eloheka has commanded you to do at these commandments and at these judgments. You shall therefore guard and do them with all your heart and with all your soul. You have avouched at Yahuwah this day to be your Elohim and to walk in his ways and to guard his statutes and his commandments and his judgments and to hearken unto his voice. And Yahuwah has avouched you this day to be his peculiar people as he has promised you and that you should guard all his commandments and to make you high above all nations which he has made in praise and in name, and in honor, and that you may be a holy people unto Yahuwah Elohecha, as he has spoken.